I would say with friends, you will have some people who will exit your life. I've actually had a lot of friends of mine who were childhood friends who said that they wanted nothing to do with me because they thought what I was doing was so atrociously bizarre. <laughs> but maybe a few years later, they came back and apologized. And you have to remember that if somebody takes something truly offensively like that, it's most likely their issue and not yours. And you cannot base your worth on somebody else's opinion because most likely they're still dealing with their own stuff inside, which is why we can only work on ourselves and hope to inspire or motivate and encourage others to have health as well. When it comes to your family, I would say a few things. Um, I would say with your family, the greatest advice I can give you would be to live as an example and when necessary and with caution, use words. I've already shared with you, my mom is from Lebanon, my dad's from Ecuador, so I grew up eating Lebanese food and Ecuadorian food, which basically in my dad's side of the family is chicken, beans, and rice with sarracha sauce every day, hot chili peppers all the time. And um, it's interesting because food for them is not just food, it's culture, it's tradition and sitting at a table eating together for a Latin American or Arabic family is how you love one another, right? Like if you've ever been in a Lebanese household, everybody's in the kitchen all the time. It doesn't matter if they're full, they're still eating. My grandmother's always like, eat, eat, eat. Because the more that I ate her food, the more it made her feel like loved. Like I loved her because I ate her food. So when I stopped eating their food, it was like, she hates me. She's abandoned me, she's abandoned our culture, she's a disgrace to the family. Um, my family, I'll just give you, uh, it only took me 13 years. It took a lot of communication, it took a lot of education on my part so that when they asked me questions I was ready to respond. But I realized that the more that I would comment on something, like if I was sitting at a table with them and if I commented on what they were eating, big no, no. Don't do that. <laughs> Nobody likes to be told that what they're doing is wrong. They'll take it offensively and then they'll blame you for it. However, if they ask about what you're eating and if you can respond with kindness and compassion and say how great you feel eating it, the first time you may get a, huh, okay, maybe one day I'll try it, right? You open a door. 